In this video I'm going to show you how to create an import file using Google Docs. The first thing you need to do is go to docs.google.com. It's a free service. Uh, docs.google.com and uh, if you already have a Google account like for Gmail or any other Google tool you'll be able to log in using that otherwise you'll set, have to get started and create a Google account which is super easy. So I'm going to go ahead and log in and you hit get started or I'm sorry you hit sign in if you are logging in and you can see I have a lot of different files in here already yours will be empty if you're just starting out and you do new and spreadsheet The first thing we're going to do is on the top row here, we're going to do first name, last name, email. Then we're going to enter some information, which I'm going to pause the video to do that. And then we're going to go up to file and in Google Docs it's export and just like before we're going to choose a .txt you could also do a .csv you don't need to worry about any of the other ones of course you could import it as an Excel sheet that wouldn't really uh, help you unless you have Excel in which case you could just use that from the beginning so we're going to do a .txt file which is a tab delimited text file and it opens it up and depending on your browser it may open it up or it may come up with a save window if it opens up like this like it has in Firefox then you can choose save page as and you just choose all files and you make sure you put it into the folder you want it to be in contact test to txt dot txt you have to put that in there hit save I believe in Excel it'll ask you if you want to save it and let's just go back real quick and see after that you can just close that window it opens in a new window and file Or I'm going to try one other thing here that may be a little easier. File, export. If I right click on that, nope, that doesn't do any better. So then I'm going to go ahead and hit uh, save and close. It asks me what I want to name it. Click OK. I have Google Docs here. And I'll have the, uh, for today I have the, the sheet here. And I can click on it and open it back up. Which means you could use the same sheet over and over again too. Gonna close that. Let's see if I have any other options here. Nope, that looks like how you have to do it. So that's how Google Docs works. It's a little clunky, not not perfect, not the not the ideal. Uh, or quite as easy as Excel, but it's pretty close, and it's free so you can't complain about that.
in the next video, I'll show you how to import these into the different uh, programs. Thanks.